Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, I just want to limit my uh, contribution on this uh, particular occasion to just addressing a couple of things that was raised uh, by the previous Greens uh, member, because there was a couple of accusations in there levelled towards the government which um, were pretty much unfounded and I think need to not go unchallenged. Uh, the way it was talked about in terms of the government trying to save um, money, Mr Speaker, I think that's kind of the role of the government to a certain degree, is it not? Uh, the only money that the government actually has control of is in fact the money that it has um, received from uh, the taxpayers of New Zealand. Uh, and so uh, sometimes they're not necessarily that willing to part with that money and so it's beholden on us to ensure that we uh, look after that. Um, uh, by in, in, in the most prudent possible way. So I think well, I think or, it's really or, important. Or, order. I just ask the member to sit. But could I also ask the junior government whip not to interject as she walks along? Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. As I was saying, I think it's really important for us to actually act in a prudent way on behalf right. of the taxpayers of New Zealand. Um, the other point that was made was that originally this um, legislation was somehow buried in another piece of uh, legislation and just being referred to as remedial matters. Well, Mr. Speaker, if there was ever anything that was a remedial matter, this matter is absolutely it. Um, what we are trying to do is remedy something that was done, as the previous speaker from New Zealand first said, um, in a legislative drafting area. Um, we're just sort of wanting to remedy that, get it tidied up, get it sorted out. Mr Speaker, there is um, really important for us to get this legislation through, to get things back on track to the way that they were always intended to be. And that is why, Mr Speaker, I think it's important that we do this under urgency and get it through in uh, the best possible time.